Oh hey, how's it going? Thanks for watching my video. So, I thought seeing as we're in Pride Month, it's probably a good time to try and gay it up a little bit in The Sims 4. So, today I'm going to be playing with the LGBT mod, which was made by Pimp My Sims. I'll leave a link to it in the description. As you might guess, it adds a load of uh, LGBT elements to the game. Never played with it before, so I guess we'll have a little bit of a fiddle now. But first off, there is something I want to show you quick. So this is Ellie. She's a teen. She's the uh, main star of this video. And when you install the mod, you actually get a new aspiration, which is uh, under the LGBTQ+. And the aspiration is to be an LGBT rights activist. Which I thought was pretty cool. You don't get any new traits, but you do get that aspiration. So yeah, this is Ellie, Mum Barbara, Dad Eric. So let's play. So just to give you an insight onto the first step of this aspiration, you have to create a social media profile, research about LGBT community on the computer, be good friends with three LGBT sims, and have a hundred followers. But we should also get a new pie menu. Here it is, LGBT mod. So in the beginning you can ponder about sexuality and you can ponder about gender identity. So we're going to have a little think about both. You know, she's a teen. Life is confusing at the moment like it is for all teens. Barbara, will you fuck off? We're trying to think about our sexuality. Questioning t trait. This sim is in the process of wondering what their gender, sexual orientation, romantic orientation or other identity is. Questioning can happen at any stage and can take anywhere from days to years. We do know that she's demisexual. This sim only experiences sexual attraction after an emotional bond has formed. She does have a few mood buffs. Who am I attracted to? Sometimes I wonder what genders I am attracted to, if any at all. And who am I? Sometimes I wonder if I was born in the right body. Jesus, I'm loving this mod already. I wonder if there's a way I can, like, set what she is in the settings menu. Settings. Oh, okay, okay. So I can remove all of her uh, traits. Set other traits. Set as an ally. Set as a drag king or queen. Set as a homophobic. Set as in the closet. Out of the closet. Transphobic. An LGBT activist. Okay. And her gender, gender fluid, non-binary, transgender, and sexuality. So at the minute, this is what she is. She's questioning. There's also pansexual, lesbian, gay, demisexual, which is apparently what she is. Bisexual, asexual, aromantic. Uh, let's put her as pan. She can be pansexual. But I am also going to put her as a, an in-the-closet pansexual. In the closet, yeah, so she can tell her parents. And you know what I'm going to do just for a laugh? I'm going to make one of her parents homophobic. <laughs> so I think the dad is... Dad is going to be not too happy about his daughter coming out. I wonder if she can come out at all. Encouraged to be open-minded? Yeah, yeah. Go partying. No. Stay back and encourage your parents to be open-minded. Discuss being pansexual versus bisexual. Oh, the endless debate on that one. Oh, he doesn't seem too happy about being open-minded. In fact, he looks like he's a bit angry too. <laughs> wait, wait. Oh dear, she's got a failure mood buff. That didn't go so well and now they're riled up. And he is pissed off from failing to convince a homophobic sim to be open-minded. These sims go against nature and nothing they say will change my mind. Fucking hell. Oh, I am sorry, Ellie. I think you're going to have your hands full with that one. Discuss, uh... He's going to hate this conversation. He's going to hate it. Encouraged to come out. Come on, Dad. Just admit the only reason you're homophobic is because you're in the closet. Discuss LGBT issues. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. Let's ask him about his sexuality right in front of our mum. So, Dad, are you gay? You gay, bro? Get excited about pride. Oh, that's really cute. Yeah, get excited about pride and then come out to him. And then she should get an out of the closet uh, buff. I write. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Look at his face. Oh, shit. Oh, no. 
Oh no. The beast has risen from the cave. Oh shit. Now I'm guessing she's got some kind of buff from coming out. Oh dear. <gasps> she's hurt from coming out to a homophobic or transphobic sim. I can't believe they would say such awful things. I really thought they would be accepting of me. Did you? Did you really think you would be accepting of you? And she's worried from being in the closet. What if someone finds out? <gasps> Disgusted from a sin coming out as transgender. That's just not natural. Well, that's not true. She didn't come out as trans. And he doesn't care about LGBT issues. Well, we knew that. What about your mum? She's not, um, she's not homophobic. You could come out to her. Come out to your mum. See what she has to say about it. I love all of these extra interactions. Oh, he's still throwing a strop. He's eating some cereal to try and console himself. Ask to donate to an LGBT charity. Oh, feeling proud from coming out as pansexual. I'm so glad I came out to this sim, knowing that they accept me for who I am is the best feeling. Oh, well, at least your mum loves you. And does she have a mood buff too? Accepting from Sim coming out. I'm so glad this Sim trusted me enough to come out to me. I'm so proud of them and will always stand by them if they need an ally. Oh, yeah. Go, Barbara. What a good egg. What a good egg. Hey, and now she's got an out of the closet um, trait now. She's out and proud. Oh, good for you, Ellie. Good for you. The pondering's going to end soon. But now she's more so just sad about her asshole dad oh it's all right ellie i wonder if he has any interactions with any new interactions that he can do on her like lecture about um sexuality or convince it's a phase or anything like that insult the lgbt community yeah fuck it she already knows you're a prick why not go the whole hog <laughs> oh funny I wonder if she can... I wonder if her mum is straight, you know? Why don't you ask her? Ask her what her sexuality is. Uh, ask about sexuality slash identity. Because I know that he is... Yeah, he's homophobic. And what about her? She doesn't really have any traits regarding uh, LGBT. But you know what? I'm going to get her to think about it. I'm going to get her to think about it. And I'm going to get him to think about it. I want to find out what they uh, what they end up being. It'd be funny if the homophobe ends up being gay. Ponder about sexuality. Oh, so he's homophobic, but he's also bisexual. And what about her? Oh, she still doesn't have one. I don't think she ever did ponder her sexuality, did she? Ponder it. Ponder it. I mean, I don't think he really can come out now, can he? After all that, I think you're going to have to stay in the closet. You're going to have to keep it to yourself now because you've been acting like a knob this whole time. No one's going to have any sympathy for you, mate. Oh, look, she's even crying in bed, the poor cow. Oh. Why don't you just get some sleep or have a wank? I'm going to get her a computer because I think there are new interactions with the computer where you can, like, research LGBT issues. And I'm hoping there's a section where you can watch some gay porn. LGBT. Oh, okay, so you can research about the community and you can write an article about it. Let's research it. Get out of bed. Research your people. And then that can go towards your aspiration, can't it? Fuck off, Dad, you hypocrite. I think we should also make a social media profile. Oh, wait, wait. That was just adding it to the timeline. But I thought maybe there were some social events that came with this. Oh shit, there is. There's the LGBT charity gala. So you can host a gala to help raise money for the LGBT charity that delivers advice, support and information services for the LGBT community. There is also... <gasps> fuck off. A drag show put on a show by singing, dancing and acting out scenes while dressed in drag. Oh, I'm all about that. Anything else? Just an LGBT meetup. Oh, fucking brilliant. LGBT protest. Are you kidding me? A coming out party? <laughs> There's loads. So that's what, five different event types. A coming out party, an LGBT protest, an LGBT meetup, a drag show, and a charity event. I mean, I would try and host one, but I don't think she has any friends. Although, 
I can take her somewhere, because I did make some sims specifically for this. So I can go and get her to introduce herself and then, and then she can host a, an event and invite them. Right, okay, this is the lot where they all live. I've just cheated her to have a friendship with them. Um, and I have just cheated us out of winter into summer. So we're going to have to give it a minute for the uh, snow to melt. But I'm pretty excited. So basically, I'm going to get her to host an event in the park, like a little pride park. And then we're going to add all of these people into our family and set their genders, their sexuality, so that we end up with a neighborhood that is pretty diverse when it comes to sexuality. So I'm pretty excited about that. I'm not too sure what would be a decent time to host an event, though. Like 6 a.m. seems a bit too early, doesn't it? Huh, it's funny. Apparently, right now, it's a heat wave and there's snow on the ground. Well, it hasn't melted yet, so this heat wave needs to hurry the fuck up. Okay, I wonder if now is too early to host an event. You can't plan a social event if you're not greeted. Fuck are you talking about? Okay, well, then I'm just going to send her home and host a, a social event. Okay, plan a social event. We're not going to school today. Oh, it's Sunday, so that's fine. No, I'm just not sure what type of event. We could do a, a drag show. Well, an LGBT meetup, an LGBT protest. So they don't actually have gold. So you know what? I'm going to go for a drag show because that one is at least gold. And we're going to invite all of our new friends. And I do actually have some drag queens. So we're going to have three. I just hope it lets me do it in the in a park. I don't think it will, will it? Oh, hang on. There we go. So we can host it at the LGBT Pride Party Village. Oh, yes. And the snow is starting to melt nicely. Right, well, you, you can change your outfit into your little pride outfit. Yay. Right, I'm going to add all of these people to my family. How does it know when I'm dressed in drag? I didn't make this lot, by the way. Um, I'll put the details up on the screen somewhere if you guys want to... you guys want to get it for yourselves. Oh, she got stung by a bee. Well, technically, dressing in drag is just try using a dresser or a closet to try on a different outfit. So I'm just going to do that just for the sake of being able to um, tick that box. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to have her... I'm going to have our drag queen here practice singing just to entertain the people and while you're doing that I'm going to assign you okay so this person is going to be gay and drag queen perfect perfect in fact I'm gonna go ahead and set assign some uh, sexualities right now this lady right here she can be oh I can't do anything until she stops skating all right we'll move along to the next person this guy over here he's got it written all over his face he can be pan he can be pansexual and gender fluid. This girl right here, she can be a lesbian. And you, my friend, you can be gay. I think this lady here can be bi. Bisexual, there we go. And I think she can be gay as well, actually. In fact, you know what? I might just set these two up together. Oh, I just realised she's got a little uh, pride flag. That's so cute. Get excited about pride. Yeah, let's start there. Let's start with getting excited about pride. Let's do some LGBT interactions. Encouraged to come out. Well, she already came out, but you should ask her about her sexuality. Ask her if she likes girls too. You don't seem to get like a pop-up or anything though to say, oh, come out as a lesbian. You don't seem to get a pop-up to say, I identify as this. Unless it's in the little cloud, like, from where they speak. Let's discuss some LGBT issues, and then we are going to lay it on her. Because these two would make just the cutest little couple, wouldn't they? That's right, go and talk to her. Go and talk to her. Aw, look at those guys just standing around watching. Oh, you guys are just so cute. You guys are so cute. You guys are looking a, a little bit awkward. <laughs> you know what, I might just help you guys along a little bit oh they can at least have their first kiss right now oh ask her to be your girlfriend oh actually she hasn't come out and told her that she's into girls too go out come out as pansexual to her because she 
She told you ages ago she was lesbian, so if you don't come out too, it just looks like you're not interested. Which is the opposite. We are very interested. Reveal crush. Yeah, reveal crush. Oh, I love this mod. This is really cute. Oh, Ask her to be your girlfriend. Tiffany is burning to death. Are you having a laugh? Shit, they're all fucking burning to death. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, well, before they all burn to death, I'm just going to show you a couple extra things that you get in this... So you do get some new uh, lot traits. So you can have a gay hotspot. So gay sims will turn up all the time. It's also, you can also get a lesbian hotspot and an LGBT hotspot. I think that's it, right? Yeah, so you could have this place a party place and also an LGBT hotspot too. And I think there's also like a new, I wanna say tradition. Uh, I might be wrong, but I think you can like, I think you can create pride. So if we were to add a holiday, Jesus, I had no idea there were so many of these fucking icons. Right, we'll go with that one. We'll go with the rainbow. Huh, this must be left over from the, uh, the drugs mod doing LSD. I mean, yeah, fuck it. We'll put that in for the, uh, celebrating pride. Fireworks, pride spirit. There we go. Murder. <laughs> there we go. Doing LSD, fireworks, pride spirit, and drinking. And just like that, we have created pride. I wonder if there's a decoration. Mm. Nah, none of these really. Maybe Love Day, actually. Love Day. Hey, and just like that, we've created pride. So there you go. That is a very uh, high level overview of this mod. I'm not installing it anytime soon. I'm sure it will play a part in many of my future videos. So anything that I've missed out here, we will definitely revisit again. But yeah, that's the LGBT mod. Install it. It's good. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.